How is everyone today? Happy Moon's Day. Um, I just I wanted to try something different today so that you could see what I wanted to show everyone here. And um, I just wanted to wait a few minutes, see if we can get anyone else to join us today. Um, my name is Lisa. I'm here at Plymouth Cards and um, Wednesday. Can you believe another Wednesday is um, here? So let's see. I wanted to talk about a few things today and one of them is going to be this box opening, which I'm um, excited about. But um, a few other things that I wanted to talk about is um, our catalog. I'm not sure if you got it yet. Um, I got mine and I've had a few customers call me and I didn't, you know, when you do those things, you, you think you check everything a million times and that's exactly what I did with the, uh, when we did this catalog, I can't tell you how many times I looked this over, proofread it, um, the whole nine yards and lo and behold, on the bottom of every page down here, on the even number pages down here, the phone numbers are. So, um, crazy, I know, totally. So what I wanted to say was that the phone number here on the back of the catalog is our correct phone number. So if you do need to call us, it's also on our website. It is, um, let's see, it is on our website. It's on every email that I send and it's on our Facebook page. It is everywhere. It's on your receipt when you place an order. So if you ever need to get in touch with us, that would be the way to do it. Um, our number is 877-830-3405. And yeah, I just, I can't believe we made that mistake. We being me, but um, I like to say we when, but it's me and I own it. I just, I don't know what happened how our phone number would have changed on the catalog from last year, but it did, it is what it is, and we'll, we'll move forward. But just if you do um, need to call us, it's the number on the back of the catalog, not the number on the inside of the catalog. Um, you can, and you'll see it on Facebook. It's on every email, et cetera, et cetera. So um, if, if you can or cannot, you know, if you can't hear me, this is a brand new thing that I'm trying today. It's called StreamYard. And I'm doing it so that you can see this box when I open it. I think it might work out better than when I'm just trying to hold it up to you. I think that might be better. So, uh, hi, Nancy. I'm so glad you're here. Thank you for saying hi. Um, so that's what I wanted to do with that. And so, um, yeah. So what I have here in this box, this little mystery box, is our fall box. So we try to do a quarterly box based on the season and it has a variety of products and it's um, typically 20% off the full retail price. So if you bought everything separate, it would be 20% more. So that's what we do with this box. We have fun with that. And so I um, just wanted to wait and see if we could get a few more people to join before I start so we don't miss out on anything. And, um, but let's see. So the box is here, let's see. So, I want to see, so how you'll receive it, you'll receive it in gift ready um, fashion. So it, we wrap it up in tissue paper and um, all our tissue paper is 100% recycled, eco-friendly. So I love that. Just like most of our, you know, our products, we try to get recycled products um, that are recycled. Oh, this is the same recycled over and over again. But <laughs> anyway, we... we um, I strive to find eco-friendly recycled products that are, you know, nice quality. So in our box, so this box retails for, let me tell you, $76 if you bought it every piece separate. So our price is going to be $59.99 and this is what you're going to, this is what it looks like when you get it. So it'd be great because it is a Thanksgiving box. If you can't go see your family at Christmas time and uh, Christmas at Thanksgiving time because of um, COVID and you want to send something along, this would be a great thing to send. So it has in it. Let's see. Okay. In this bag are the Buffalo print flat note cards. So the flat note card, and it, it includes the twine. So 
the note cards are really cute. They're you can either have them flat like this and see the other side is completely blank or you can fold them in half and punch a hole and then we're providing the twine with them. We have about eight different prints available but in this box is going to be the the buffalo plaid. It comes with the red twine, solid red twine. So this retails for $4.99 if you bought ten of that, a 10 pack or $3.99 without the twine. So that's totally up to you. But I went so that that will come in a, in a fun bag. The bags are recycled. Sorry if I just made you sick by hitting the camera. So this is totally a new thing for me to try today. So I appreciate you hanging out with me while I do it. So um, we're also going to include a hope ornament because we feel like at Thanksgiving time, it's a time um, just for hope and thankfulness. So we have the hope ornament and that those sell individually for $10, just like all our ornaments. And um, let's see what else is in here. Oh my gosh, these are adorable. I hope you like them as much as I do. They're a little gift tag. So you get a dozen gift tags uh, and you can actually use them for place settings if you are seeing your family. Sorry, I'm off here. Maybe that's better. There we go. Um, so there's six pumpkins in our color ember, and then there's six turkeys. Check out how adorable these are. Little turkeys, and there's six of those, and they're in nutmeg. So you can see that. Let me know if you think that this is a good format, if I'm going to show things like this in the future, or if you prefer that I just hold things up like this to the camera. I'm not sure what you like better. So let me know. I'd love to hear. Um, so those are the gift tags. So gift tags, our gift tags are made from recycled paper, just like our cards. They're $3.99 for a 12-pack. They do come with the twine. Um, in this set, in this set, you will get six pumpkins and six turkeys. They come with orange and white twine, yellow and white twine for each, just like this. But if you bought them separately on our website, they would be $3.99. And you would have your choice of, I think, 15 different twine colors. So if yellow isn't your thing and you prefer you wanted to have orange you can totally do that on our website pick and choose uh, let's see what else is in the box so you'll get a gold pen and i'm going to demonstrate with a my used not not that one uh, in a few minutes so also you're gonna get so we wrap everything we use um recycled not recycled we use newspaper that we get from our local newspaper and it's never been read it's just overruns that they have so they've printed too many and so they bundle it up and then uh, once a month I go down there and I pick it up and we use it to be eco-friendly um, but then we also wrap the cards in tissue paper you can see that and then all our cards come wrapped in our eco-friendly cardboard wrap if you can see that that's better so and then the twine you can reuse and I'll show you where you can reuse it um, you can be reused inside our packaging we have gift tags that you can cut out so it's just another way to repurpose our packaging so in that little um, cardboard wrap comes uh, let's see four six cards four of them are blank in in our burnt orange and they say grateful on them and they and that's in our gold foil and they come with our cream felt envelope. It's a really nice textured envelope. Then you also get two of our greetings from the past Thanksgiving cards in this box. This is one of our brand new designs, Thanksgiving greetings. Um, so there's that one. And then there's this other one called a happy Thanksgiving um, pilgrim of Plymouth Rock. So we are from Plymouth, Massachusetts. So this was very appropriate for us. And you get two of the white envelopes with that. So those six cards come in that. Now, the the greetings from the past cards are $2.99 each. Yes, $2.99. And we have an array of options. And then the foil cards are, so with the envelope upgrade, they're $2.09. But if you didn't get the uh, um, envelope upgrade, it would be $1.89 and Go foil. We have one font option at this point. This is the font option. There we go. Um, so that's the font option. And 
we can fit up to, I believe, 20, 22 characters. So, you know, if you have a message that you want to say that you think would look great in foil. Oh, and we also have, um, I believe, eight to 10 different foil colors. So that, that's really cool. They look really nice on the dark cards where you typically can't do custom printing because we don't have white ink at this point. So, um, but the foil looks really nice. And so that's also included in the box. And then let's see what else we have. All right. Again, our newspaper with Legoli. And the tissue paper just keeps it clean. I worry that the, some of the newsprint might come off in transport. So I don't want you to get dirty envelopes or cards. So I do that. And then the gift tag, of course, we always put tags that you can then reuse, repurpose with the twine that's on the wrap if you so choose. And inside this wrap is 24 cards, and there's 12 buffalo plaid and 12 of our vintage flare. The vintage flare has faux um, corners. Do you remember? Um, I remember when I was a kid, we had um, envelopes of these little, I'll put them up close, the corners that you would have to lick and stick to put your pictures in your scrapbooks or your photo albums. So I just love, I love nostalgia. Um, so that's that card. You can see the that. So this set, if you bought each card separately, would be uh, it's thirty five seventy six. But again, this whole box, I'm not done yet, is um, fifty nine ninety nine instead of the seventy six dollars that it would be if you bought everything separate. And then also we're going to include is some gift bags with the tissue paper. All our gift bags that we sell are 100% recycled, made here in the USA, just like all our products. And they, um, and we have a few options. So this one is, this is our small size. And, ooh, let's see, I should demonstrate the small size. I'm going to just put this, not very prettily, but just to give you a visual. So here's the small bag, just to give you a visual. And then I'm going to take our 24 card collection and look at that. It fits perfectly right in that bag. So, you know, if you wanted to just give the cards to somebody and you want to keep everything else for yourself, that would be perfect. All our gift bags, I think I already said, but I'm sorry, I'm getting myself confused here, come with tissue paper and they come with a coordinating tag. You know, usually we do something seasonal. So right now we would do turkeys and pumpkins or, and then um, we have Christmas trees, snowmen, um, stockings. We have so many options available. So that is it. So um, the fall box, when I get off, I will post the link to the fall box if you're interested. We only have a limited number where we have 10. Oh, shoot. So we also have an upgrade available and I'm gonna do my usual, I forgot something, I'm gonna be right back, hold on. So you can upgrade to include a picture frame. Let me show you. So you can upgrade. So the box itself is $59.99. We have 10 of boxes available of that. Sorry, hi, I'm back. So we have 10 boxes available. And then we also have 10 boxes available with a picture frame upgrade. So you can get the weathered gray picture frame included. And that would make the price $76.99. So that would be an additional savings too. So, and our picture frames are, they're handmade um, by a small business in Maine. And so that's this one. And it, it's glass, it's not plastic or plexiglass or anything like that, that's real glass. So those are the two box options that I wanted to mention. And then I wanted to show you, so I have my little fancy camera here. Um, I wanted to show you what it looks like when you write inside the card. Um, I'll just write. Oh, probably not the best. There we go. Hello. Nice to see you. This table is um, a little groove, so it's not the best. But I just wanted to show you what the gold looks like. I love the gold on the cards. It just adds such a nice touch to them. So that's the gold pen. 
And that is everything that gets in the box. So if you have any questions about the box, please feel free to write them in the comments. And um, yeah, I'd be happy to answer them. Benny or I will put the link in um, as soon as this live is done and posted. With this new program for today, I'm not exactly sure how I should have probably figured this all out, but that's just how it goes here. Um, so there's all that. Um, what else did I want to tell you? Okay, get my notes out here. Oh, okay. We've gotten a lot of calls because we're a small business that people have never heard of. Plymouth Cards, no one's ever heard of. Not no one, but we're small. We're a small family business, and we've been in business since 2005. But you, um, with Clarence, there's been a lot of um, activity for our company. So, but people are calling and asking us, you know, if we're real. Yes, we're real. Uh, I'm real. I don't think. Um, yeah. So what we were doing is um, Benny actually um, spent some time and she's written a blog post that we're going to be posting on the next day. As soon as it's available, we'll be posting it on our Facebook page. But it's how to determine if an online company is reputable because it is that time of year. The holidays are coming and there's so many unethical businesses. Um, I know people personally that have been a, you know, a, a, a victim of these um, unreputable companies that are online they just make up all these names and it's crazy so um we benny and i had a conversation and we talked about different ways that you know her and i both things we do to make sure a company is real that when we're buying from them for the first time yeah you know, obviously the gap you know, everyone knows that and pottery barn or target walmart you know everyone knows all those stores but for the smaller businesses like myself it's hard um and we just want to try to help you all um, be able to figure out, you know, if a company is real. So some of our tips is, um, look at their contact page. I always go to, and whenever I go to a new company's website that I've never shopped for before, I go to their contact page and I make sure, is there an address? If there isn't an address, I never buy from them. It's an automatic, no way. Because I don't know if you, if you just don't put an address, where are you? It just, it makes, that makes me uncomfortable. Look for a phone number. If there's not a phone number, deal breaker. <laughs> and um, sometimes, and actually I've gotten, I've fielded a lot of calls over the last few weeks from customers calling. They're like, I'm about to place my order online, but I wanted to call and make sure you were real. And so um, feel free to do that. Call companies. They're happy to do that and answer any of your questions, the reputable ones. Um, but keep in mind, small companies like ours, we only have one phone line. So if we don't answer in their voicemail message, leave a message we'll call you back um that you know or try calling again but we figured is it better to have multiple phone lines or keep our prices affordable so we've opted for affordable pricing instead of bells and whistles i hope you can appreciate that and understand that so but those are some things you know and sometimes when you google the address you're going to see a small business homeowner's home and i'm okay with that um, but I just want to make sure that it isn't some random field in the middle of nowhere. So that kind of makes you feel better when you, when you do the Google search to make sure that it's real. Um, what other things? Check their social media presence. Um, not everyone's on all social medias. We do have, you know, handles on all of the social medias, but honestly, we've decided to focus our energies on Facebook and Pinterest. Those are just, there's just too many. We can't handle it all. But, but whenever I do go to look at a new company, I go and I look and look at their social media and see which one they're actually active on or if they are active. If they're not, that makes me nervous too, especially if they're advertising online and they don't have a online social media present, that makes me nervous. And maybe I'm nervous about too much, but anyway, I'm just trying to share some tips and tricks to help you protect yourself, especially as we get further into the holiday season and I know there's going to be these dot-com companies that are just going to be popping up all over that are not ethical um, or reputable. So what I was saying, yeah, check their social media presence and then see if they actually are communicative with their customers. Are they responding to questions or is it just people commenting and nothing from the company? I feel it's really important for a company to respond try to respond as quickly as possible 
Um, but within 24 hours, I feel like a company should be responding to their customers' questions. And yeah, to be, it's just, so if a company isn't responding, um, then I would be hesitant to purchase from them and just see what kind of posts they're making is, uh, yeah, you just want to just check it all out and make sure I don't need to be all serious, but I just want everyone to be protected. And, you know, especially since I know people that have, you know, fallen victim and that's terrible. To, you know, we work hard for our money. We don't want it taken away from us by some unreputable company. So um, the blog post is almost done. And as soon as it is, we will post it here. I hope you find it useful. And if you have any of your own ideas after you read it, please let us know because I'm all about education and I would love for all of us to be educated on ways to protect us as a group. You know, we all have to work together and um, we're all big teams. So I think that would be really great if everyone could do that. So, so the fall box to wrap up, the fall box is available on the website now. We do only have 10 of each available. I'm not sure if any have sold while we've been on live or throughout the day. And let's see. Oh, and the Send Love campaign is that's an ongoing thing. And in case you missed last week's um, live or you missed um, the email, what the Send Love campaign is, is that I know we're all so busy with our lives. And so our whole greeting card section, if you just, you know, um, today you're like, oh, I miss my friend Sue. I haven't seen Sue in such a long time and I'd love to, you know, send her some, a card. But then the day goes by and you, you never get to it. And then a week goes by and you still haven't gotten to that card that you want to send to Sue. So what, what we're doing is you can buy a single card on our website. They're $2.99. And um, in order to waive our $5 shipping, what you do is use the code send love in the discount code section and it will take off the shipping and then just in the ship to address put your friend Sue's address and then we'll um, and you can put a message in there too that you want us to send to her and we'll take care of it and we'll send your card off to your friend Sue or your Uncle Joe or anyone in your that you want to send a card to um, I just feel like it's so important especially now as we get further into the holidays or the the winter is coming and I just I just I want people to have some love in their mailbox instead of just the bill all the time or junk mail. So that is the Send Love campaign. If you have any questions about it, you can always just pop a message here and I'm happy to answer them. And let's see, I think that's everything I have. So our phone number was wrong on the catalog in case you missed that. 877-830-3405 is the correct phone number. I won't make that mistake again. Um, and you can always, you know, Facebook message us, call, um, or email is what I meant to say. Yeah. And I hope you have a great rest of your day, your week. And, um, yeah, I really appreciate you watching and let me know if you have any other questions or ideas. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks so much. Bye.